What happens after Olympic glory? For diver Matty Lee, a return to the gruesome preseason training rather than launching himself off a 10-meter platform alongside diving partner Tom Daly, he now finds himself house-sitting for his teammate and fellow gold medalist when the pair took gold in the men's synchronized 10-meter platform in July. It was the first Olympic medal of Lee's young career and the third for Daly, who also went on to win a bronze in the 10-meter platform in Tokyo. I am still finding it very weird to be back at training. I'm like, do I really want to be here? This is really hard, says Lee. Preseason isn't easy in any sport. It's where you get back into fitness. It's gruesome, but I just know I need to get through this bit, get back in shape, then I'll feel good and then I can set goals. So I'm not rushing to any conclusions. Added to the challenge of preseason is that Lee is doing it all without Daly by his side, the British pair had trained and competed together for three years leading up to the Olympics, forming an unbeaten partnership throughout 2021. But it's unclear whether the duo will continue to compete together, with Lee saying he doesn't want to pastor the 27 year old Daly to make a decision while he's in North America with his husband, screenwriter Dustin Lance Black. I loved training alongside Tom for the past three years, and it feels really flat without him, Lee adds. We get along so well, and we have literally trained together for the past three years. Everything we do, we do it together. Because obviously with Synchro, we're trying to build that bond where we don't have to think about being in sync, it's all very telepathic. Read, how male artistic swimmers are striving for acceptance guarding the gold medal and while most of his medals are stored in a cabinet at his parents' home. The Olympic gold rarely leaves his side. I feel like it just needs to be wherever I am says Lee. I let people touch it, I let people wear it, I let people hold the weight, but I've always got a good grip on the ribbon itself, because if they drop it, then I'll catch it. So it's yet to get a dent on it. I can't believe I did that in order to win gold in the men's synchronized 10-meter platform, Lee had to hold his nerve as the final went down to the wire. Daily and Lee led the Chinese pair of Chao Yuan and Chen Isen by less than two points ahead of the last round. When crunch time arrived, they claimed the gold with a flawless, four and a half somersault dive. It was Britain's first ever gold medal in the event and ended China's winning run that stretched back to 2000. It's interesting to look back on it, says Lee. Every so often, I come across a video I've been tagged in on Instagram or whatever, and it's my dive or my reaction with Tom. And I can't believe I actually did that. But just to know that I actually did it when it actually counted on the biggest stage in the world in sport, me and Tom, it was obviously the best moment of my life. Which begs the question, how did he manage to produce one of the best dives of his career when it mattered most? My physical strength has always been there, I've been able to do the dives. I know I can do them well because I do them in training. But in the competition, it's all mental. You've got to have no doubt in your mind, you can't think ahead of your dive. He's the only synchro partner I've ever had where it's just been like, I know he's fine says Lee. While it remains unclear whether Lee and Daly will dive together again, the former's focus remains on his training. Last week, that also involved participating in TRX training as part of the UK's National Fitness Day initiative on top of his diving commitments. Although the Olympic spotlight has dimmed, the preparation and routine are as intense as ever. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.